didn't expect to come here. That looks really cool. I like it. Shame you can't see much though. It's like, honestly like a ruined castle, isn't it? I'm glad it's not too close. If it was your first time doing that race and you didn't manage to see the views because of the fog and because it was getting dark, I came here for a walk to film it all. Hello everyone. Today is Wednesday the 23rd of August. I'm here in Rossendale in Lancashire in a place called Love Club to do golf ball fell race. I could see it. Well done, Mark Will. I knew you're ready. I want to see that golf ball. Where is it? And Olivia is here with me. She came here to support me. <laughs> it's called Golf Ball Fell Race because we are going to run past this weather station that has a massive golf ball. I'll try to film it. I've already registered. I've got my lucky number on, number four. The race is 5.5 miles long with approximately 800 feet elevation. The actual distance turned out to be about 5.8 miles with 1,000 feet elevation. The race registration was at Social and Bowling Club. I'd never been to Love Club before, so we came quite early. The race organizer was Jan Kempson and his Rosendale Harriers team. The registration was on the day and the entry fees were only five pounds. It was a bit crammed inside, so Olivia and I went outside of the bowling green to admire the garden around it. This is green bowling ground, I think. All people like playing it. And now let's meet the runners before the race and look at all the pre-race commotion, hustle and bustle. They look amazing. All three are Crinton and Radcliffe. Most of the runners were from Lancashire clubs. Rochdale and Rossendale had the biggest turnout. These are Rochdale Harriers. After I've taken this picture, some more Rochdale runners joined in for this photograph. Rossendale Harriers, I think, had the biggest group of runners. Well, they were the organising club. Westham Road runners also came to do this off-road race. Red Roses, come on, get together quickly. There's not that. The, the rest of you are warming up, aren't they? Yeah. I'm going to leave this pre-race commotion footage running as it is for a bit. I won't be able to film everyone running because I'm going to be taking part in the race myself. So maybe you can spot yourself or your friends before the race. More at roses. <laughs> there, got you too. These are the runners from Chorley Athletics Club that I managed to take pictures of. Other Chorley runners unfortunately didn't get into the shot. The full course is marked with red and yellow flags. There's marshals on every trick point. I positioned myself closer to the start so I could film your running bottoms flying away from me. I'm going to take you along the course of the race from my perspective and film the runners around me. 
but because there was such a rainy day, the visibility along the course wasn't very good. That's why the following day I came back to this area to have a proper look around. So during the race footage, every now and then I'm going to insert the shots of the views on a clearer day. Today is the 24th of August, the day after the race. And I came here again with my daughter and the dog for a walk from Hapton this time. On a clearer day, just to show you the views where we were running along and to have a nice walk as well. Yesterday evening it was all covered in foggy clog and also it was getting dark. So I think it's worth coming here again to have a look at the views properly. And now let's carry on along the course of the race. Say your home is where the heart is, but my heart is wild and free. So am I homeless or just heartless? Did I start this? Did it start me? I've seen it before. <laughs> Say fear is for the brave, for cowards never staring in the eye. So am I fearless to be fearful? Does it take courage to learn how to cry? So many winding roads. So many miles to go When I start feeling sick of it all It helps to remember I'm a brick in the wall It runs down from the hillside to the sea Second queue, who said there was only one? What's the club? Lonsdale. Bolton Harriers. Ah, looks a bit like Lonsdale. The colours. When I start feeling that it's gone too far, I lie on my back and stare up at the stars. I wonder if they're staring back at me. When I start feeling sick a little, it helps to remember I'm a brick in the wall. Down from the hillside to the sea. Liam from Accrington is oh. running. I want to see that golf ball. 
Where is it? When I start feeling that it's gone too far, I lie on my back and stare up at the stars. Wonder if they're staring back at me. Come on, everybody, what are you doing? What's the name of this hill? What? What? Hambledon Hill. Hambledon Hill. Right, Hambledon Hill. Right. It's you and me again, Liam. Run away from me! Run away! Careful! It's so much fun. Some kind of a quarry. Oh, I know this quarry. Oh, that's a cool quarry. Oh, you can't really see much, unfortunately. I love this stone quarry at the top of the hill. It looks like magical ruins of a fairy tale castle. Hapton Stone Quarry, just below Hamilton Hill and above oh, the village called this. Hapton, is very popular amongst mountain bikers. There's an ancient local legend that the devil once jumped from Hamilton to Pendle Hill where he gathered rocks in an apron and threw a boulder aimed at Clitheroe Castle. Great Hamilton Hill opens up a view onto a famous Pendle Hill. I love this quarry Liam, it's so pretty! Okay, thank you! Wow, that's so beautiful! You can't see much. <laughs> oh yes, you can see it now on a clearer day. All this scenic view. The Pendle Hill was on our left hand side when we were running along the quarry, which we didn't see during the race because of the poor visibility. This is the same place during the race and the day after the race in different weathers. Hapton is the village at the bottom of this valley where I started my walk from the day after the race. I went down that path. I didn't expect to come here, that looks really cool! I like it! Shame you can't see much though. You can now. It's like, honestly like a ruined castle, isn't it? The stones were very slippery and the terrain was quite technical, so people were slowing down, trying to be careful on this descent. We were running together for a while, with a few runners chatting and laughing, and it didn't even feel like a race, it felt like a one big social run, made out of runners from different clubs. That was good, well done, throw then. Let me feel you from the front now, one second. Oh no. Hi Steve! Well oh, done! Look at this! Like a proper scree! Well, that would look like if I could see it through the camera, you can't see it. It's like a gut, where is it? Cloth? Really cool! All of that we missed in the clog. Oh look Olivia, there's another flag from the race. I found three all together. Three flags from the race. At least it's not so close. I'm glad it's not too close. But my heart is Wild and free. So many you can't really see it, it's too wide world. in the fog. Oh, there you are, well done for making it. So many miles yeah, to yeah. go. Well, were you late? Yeah. Well, well done, Blackpool. I knew young lady. Mm -hmm. Come in! What a cool race! I really like it! Where are you going? Where? Uh, uh. Man, guys, don't let me catch! 
this ice is absolutely amazing. I love it. Come on, keep going. This beautiful forest. Thank you, Marshalls. Thank you. I've nothing left to see. Thank you. Thank you. So many wine roads. This race is so good. So good. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you. Four, number four. Well done. Thank you. Well done for making it, for coming here. Well done. Well done. Well done. Well done. Come on, let's shake hands. We were running together all the time. Well done. Well done, guys. Well done. Well done, guys. Well done. Well done, you too. Well done. Bolton United Harriers. I don't know why I've never seen your club before. Not sure. Ross and Dale. This is Wesham. Wesham actually put proper effort into it. They all come to Inter Club, not like my Preston Club. <laughs> Somehow they don't. Let's take a picture of all of you guys. Ian, you, you don't need to be tall. You're fine as you are. Well done. Well done, guys. Well done. Well done. Well done. Let's take a picture of the roses. Three is alright. Come on, Alison. Well done. Why are you still smiling? Well done. Well done. Well done! <laughs> well done, Sally! Well done! Well done! You made it! Well done! Well done! Well done, Sally! There's no race without you! No interclub without Sally! Well done! Look how good this team is! They all waited for each other! Amazing! People may know she got cancer a few weeks ago. And we're raising money for John Muir Trust, which we're both a member of. Those who don't know John Muir Trust, we've got a This is Joel Taylor. He runs for York, but used to be in Rossendale. And he won this race. Well done. Congratulations. 